of Mayhem. Welcome back to another episode of This is the Only Thing I Can Say at the Beginning of a Video. Hi, what's up? Everybody having a great time? I hope you are having the most fantastic time of your life because I am certainly having a great one here, okay? Let me let me show you something, okay? I did some more work with this beacon over there. Uh, like, can I do this? Yes, I can. Okay, good good stuff. Now, um, I, th I figured this be beacon loop looked a little bit uh, bland. So I added in the occasional free-floating glass pane. These act as a kind of a particle effect, so to say. I think they do quite a lot, especially at night. They give uh, they give really nice reflections with the beacon beam and stuff and that kind of stuff. Um, I will be incorporating end rods in the future if I can manage to find some. Um, but we're gonna get there at some point, right? Um, today I want to do something different, okay? Um, this place, I've been kind of envisioning it as like a European beach island, kind of, kind of the European equivalent to a tropical island, you know? It's kind of, it's kind of tropical, kind of vibrant everywhere, but it's still kind of, still not Carib Caribbean style of trees, but still like more European style, just because I'm way more familiar with this and I wanna... I want to get this island nostalgic, okay? I want to get it so nostalgic that I cry when I see it. That's the plan. So, um, obviously, um, doing something like this um, means that I cannot miss the beach area, okay? Looking at this entirely bland green space here makes me want to build a beach here, okay? There's a few things, though, that I need to do before I can, um, before I can start transforming this area into sand. And yeah, I'm getting it all beachy and stuff. Um, first, I need to do some terraforming. Um, so I'm gonna grab myself the shovel. So I grab my shovel <laughs> and shovel the fuck out of the beach, right? That's uh, at least the plan, right? Uh, can I have? Yes, I can. Nice, good stuff. All right, let's get going. Okay, there we are. Uh, I spent about, uh, let's say, an hour, maybe two hours, trying to get all this sand in place. And something, something really weird happened. Uh, you remember that golem, right? I've named, him, I've named him Igor. Igor, the iron golem, has been wandering around this place for a while, and it seems that um, he got himself stuck in the floor somehow. Hi, Igor. Um, am I gonna help you out there, or am I just gonna? No. Nah, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna leave you right there where you are. I think it's actually quite funny that he's like right there. Uh, some people, when they're on the beach, you know, they are, uh, oh, look at that, clear lag, useful. Okay, some people, when they're on the beach, they're like uh, kind of half burying themselves in the, in the sand, you know, like to shoulder height, to head height. <laughs> and this is apparently exactly what this guy has done. Um, I mean, he's not suffocating. I think it would suffocate if I were to place another block on here, but I'm not gonna do that. I think I'm just gonna keep him here. He doesn't go away, and we don't get any more as long as he's here. So why not have him here, stuck here in the sand? <laughs> this is the coolest thing, oh my god. How did he... I have no idea. Well, let's just get going on this, okay? You've, see, you've, seen, um, you've seen me kind of uh, terraform this place a little bit. Um, I've made sure that there was always this uh, this little overhang of dirt there. I think that makes a lot of sense to have it right here. Um, yeah, so I had to kind of raise this as like a border around this sand kind of stuff because it's kind of hard to blend it in with the grass because it's so vibrant, you know. If we were in the desert or something, we could blend it in a lot easier. But this is going to be perfectly fine, okay? So 
in the future I'm gonna have more trees on, uh, on the entire island basically everything is gonna be covered in trees at some point I just can't be bothered to do it right now so we're gonna have it quite bare at the moment um, I'm gonna plan out a little path here I think it's gonna go around here stay on this here for a while and then kind of fade out on this this path here this bit um, I want to make this thing look a little bit more like a a uh, what is it called a beach area recreational waterfront park thing um, I want to incorporate some little fancy things that some people tend to have on their beach um, for example there is these weird little chair things you know I don't even know terminology what the fucking hell but I'm gonna put one right here so you actually know exactly what's going on I'm gonna put one right here um, these are like this and then they have this little armrest thing on the side like that um, and then next to those things uh, we very often have these little uh, sun like shadow making things these little I don't even know what they're called uh, I would call them like umbrellas but that's the term for those that work in the rain but these are made for sun I don't know if they have a different word in German they have a different word for it um, well basically uh, most of these things they have like different stripes and like patterns on the on the fabric so I'm gonna make uh, these here these are quite cool because if, uh, I can put them right here freestanding but I can also put them hanging on things right so if I put this thing yeah we have a carpet on top of here and then if I put that right there huh now that's some cool stuff huh actually it doesn't even move I think these are supposed to move I don't know if they move in 1.94 uh, but and they're basically supposed to move well I don't even care so let's oh it's getting dark let me let me do something about this right all right well basically these go on top on the side of these okay so I use some white to make the pattern but then I don't even need the white anymore I can just do it like this and then doesn't even consume any bone meal <laughs> okay good stuff right so if I just put them on the side like this this looks like a an umbrella that's been kind of flopped downwards you know uh, I don't even know what, what's the correct terminology. I'm gonna put another one of those things on the other side of here. Um, I'm gonna put it right there. Yeah, and I'm gonna uh, sprinkle some more of these. Oh, what the crap? Some more of these uh, all over the place where I think it makes some sense to have them. Uh, one there is kind of okay. Uh huh. I want another one a little bit more over here so it's a little bit closer to the water line so I'm gonna put one where do I want the central thing here okay so yeah let me do this off camera all right yeah that looks quite fitting that looks good as well yeah I quite like how this is turning out okay next up I need some dead bushes where do I get them I think I can just grab them from a nearby mesa biome um, I think I'm gonna also move this crafting table I want to keep a crafting table here because I think it's part of the aesthetic of this game to have crafting tables around and I think they also add something a at least a little bit of it so if I just put one down there that occupies this space a little bit more that's also very nice okay so dead bushes can I use a shears or do I need silk touch well I will see let me make a shears uh-huh okay let me go up to one of these bushes like this and yes yes good stuff okay give me a few of these okay we have that bushes so if I put them I can't even put them on the grass can I know okay so I'm gonna put them not right there but I'm gonna put them somewhere close to this uh, a little bit closer to the outside edges and I'm gonna try to do it in an irregular pattern yeah see this is already much too regular you see this this is a line why do I have a line I didn't want a line 
didn't sign up for any lines here. So I'm gonna have to break this up in a way. Okay, let me do that, okay? Okay, we have some dead bushes on the beach. Okay, that's some good stuff. But I still want some more different things, okay? Uh, first of all, this beach needs some structure. This is just too much stone run, too much sand right now. And I don't like the the blockiness of this thing. So I'm gonna occasionally add in some sandstone slabs here just to smoothen up this curve a little bit, okay? Okay, that is the basic shape of our beach. We have some slabs in. I think I may have overdone it a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna keep refining that off camera as always, but there is more things that need to be done. Um, the biggest uh, reason why I put those actually in place is something completely different, guys, because um, now that I have something here that cannot fall, I have a block under which I can hide water sources. That's awesome because that means that I can put sugar canes on the beach just like this. Now that adds a little bit to the fauna of this place and I'm gonna do it all over the place. All right, I have put some sugar cane in place and look at this place. Oh wow, I think it's absolutely beautiful. I mean, just check this out guys, it's absolutely adorable. I have absolutely, I'm totally out of words. Okay, this looks so lush and vivid and stuff. It's so pretty. Okay, so there is, uh, I want to continue this path here, okay? I want to continue it um, over the beach and then it kind of fades out. That's kind of what I try to do here. I want to bring it here or something and then it fades out towards this end, right? Um, how do I actually do that? Well, first I'm going to have to continue it over here until it reaches that edge of course like this and I can even bring it around here and then I can yeah I'm gonna have to refine this edge a little bit more um, if I put dirt there and then I adapt this edge a little bit more uh-huh and then I get left with a path that ends very abruptly at the beach well I'm gonna I'm gonna do something here. If I go and grab myself a few blocks of grass, uh, yeah, like that. Just still casually thrusting my head into the walls. Um, I'm gonna learn it at some point. I'm gonna I'm gonna learn from my mistakes at some point. But whatever. Okay. So if I take out this this is a little fancy little thing that I found out. Um, path blocks and sand mix in really nicely. Uh, potentially not in this shaders pack but usually they do. So I think what I wanna do here is I wanna just bring out these grass blocks here. I know they're really ugly, uh, just hitting the, the stupid sand here like this, but if I take my shovel and I path them, yeah, they work kind of okay. Gonna have to be very careful with how I let it fade out though. This is gonna be pretty tricky. All right, check this out. Um, I've been spending a little bit more time trying to optimize this path, and this is gonna blow your mind. This is gonna be so beautiful. Look at this, look at this. Oh my God, now it opens up to the beach and slowly fades out into the beach. Oh, this is so comfortable. This feels so welcoming. My God, this is so perfect. I love it so much. Okay, now, yeah, let's, let's, uh, Hi, still enjoying your visit, dude? I'm gonna name you, I'm gonna have to name you. Let me let me go get a name tag. I think I should have one somewhere. Um, if I go in here, I think it should be in, my, in one of my toolboxes. Yes, I have one left, perfect. Okay, now let's rename this. Um, where is my, yeah, where else would it be? It's always in here. Never move it anywhere, so what the crap, okay. I'm going to name this, um, what about Igor the Beach Golem? Or I'm going to call him a Sand Golem. That's a little bit more Snad Golem, yes! <laughs> Snad Golem, that would be it. But Igor the Sand Golem. Yes, that's going to be Igor. Okay, now I want to bring this over to my friend and make him a member of the Mayhem Island community crew, okay? 
Yeah, there he is. You got the sand column. Nice. Good stuff. Okay. Now, there's one more thing I want to do. That is, as always, the map. Okay, you see? Oh, that's the beacon beam. Just crossing from the sun rotation, you can see? Cool stuff, huh? Okay, now... Oh, this is gonna be so much. There's gonna be so much sand here. Holy crap. Yeah, there's a lot of sand there. Okay. Yeah, but I think it's gonna be a welcome addition to the Mayhem Island. Yes. If I put this here... Uh-huh. Nice little sandy area. I like it. I like it very much. All right. Anyway, I think uh, this is going to be doing it for today's episode. I'm all out of time, okay? So uh, if you've enjoyed it, please make sure to leave a like down below. Always makes my day every single time. So please make sure to uh, smash your head on the keyboard in the comment section. Yeah, as always, right? My name is Mayhem, and I'm out. See you guys later in the next episode. Bye!